Well, new here at four, the man accused of a drunken crash that killed a St. Louis police officer recently now says he's not guilty. First Alert 4 Chief Investigator Lauren Traeger, the only reporter inside that courtroom today. And Lauren, another step in this tragic case was taken today. Yeah, that's right. Chavez Rodriguez is accused of driving while intoxicated in a case that is casting wide ripples, both as political fodder in political ads because Chavez Rodriguez is living in the country illegally, but also because a family and a whole police department are forever impacted by the loss of police officer David Lee. Lee had stopped on I-70 to assist with a separate crash on September 22nd when prosecutors say Chavez Rodriguez crashed into him. Officer Lee later died at the hospital. Rodriguez was out on probation for a DWI and domestic assault in 2020 in St. Peter's. He is living in the country illegally from Honduras. Today he pleaded not guilty after a judge informed him that a grand jury had a affirmed the original charges from the prosecutor's office. The judge has now set another hearing for him on December 5th. Well, and Lauren, on that immigration case, uh, is there an update with that at all? Yeah, certainly something that people have been wondering about. He does have a hold on him for ICE. That is the federal immigration agency. So that means he will not be released on bond. He has to stay in jail. He does have an open immigration case and did have one prior to this case happening. But I've been told by his attorney that has now been actually put on pause so that the criminal case can move forward first. And we mentioned too that you were the only reporter that was in that courtroom today. What was his demeanor like? Well, he did have to use an interpreter for court proceedings. That's something he's had to do. Uh, English is a language barrier here. Several family members, supporters of him were actually in court yet again today. They've been there in the past. And at one point he did actually blow a kiss to them. We did ask his attorney to comment on this, but he has declined at this time. All right, Lauren, a story that will continue to follow. Thank you.